Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a new series that I'm starting on here on my YouTube channel called Tip Tuesday. So how Tip Tuesday works is every Tuesday I'm going to upload a mini tip tutorial. So how it works is I'm just going to show you how to either apply mascara without getting it onto your eyes or how to whiten your teeth or how to remove blackheads or short weight on how to reduce acne so many different things i'm going to upload them every tuesday and they're going to be outside of my normal tutorials that i'm going to upload here on my channel so today's video is going to be how to instantly mattify a lip color any lip color because obviously the trend nowadays is having the liquid lipsticks, having the matte lip that'll last all day long without budging, without smearing, without getting on your food or your drinks, and so this way you won't have to reapply. So what I'm going to do is show you how to instantly take any lip color and change it into a matte no matter what texture it is. And this way you won't always have to go out and buy a liquid lipstick or you won't have to always go out and buy that matte lipstick. You can just take these few simple products and achieve any look that you want to. So if you would like to see how to instantly mattify your lipstick, then just keep watching. So there's a couple of products that you're going to need. The first thing that you're going to need is a lip primer. This is my Prep and Prime pen from MAC. It's actually, it's, it looks white, but it goes on clear. And this just acts as a double-sided tape. So what this does, it helps so that way your lipstick will last a little bit longer. It doesn't crack, it doesn't bleed, it doesn't smear. Put this on for a couple minutes let it dry and then you go on to apply your other products i love this because of whenever i use this i really don't feel as though that i have to reapply it at all so this is definitely a must and then what you're going to need is what depending on whatever color lip you're going to do for that day you need to have a lip liner so the one that i'm going for today is a deep burgundy this one is bespoken for by mac and then what you're going to need is your lipstick. The color that I'm going with today is kind of sexy. Love this one. It's like a nice mauve pink. This is what I'm going for today. And then you're going to need something to apply your powder. I'm using a triangle wedge because I don't really like getting my lip products on my brushes. So because these are disposable, I just take this and I just put this right on my lip and I can just throw it right in the trash. And then you're going to need a translucent powder. The one I'm going to use today is the Laura Mercier translucent powder. I actually use that for my face and I'm going to use that on how to mattify the lip. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing I'm going to do, I'm just going to take my Prep and Prime pen by MAC and I'm just going to apply this all over my lips. You just going to apply all over. And it acts as a moisturizer as well, so you can actually wear this by yourself if you wanted to. And I'm just going to let that sit there for a little bit, let it dry, get a little bit tacky, and then we're going to go on to our lip liner. So I wanted to zoom in a little bit closer for you guys to see. So I already applied the lip primer, and now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go and I'm just going to take my Bespoken For Lip Pencil by MAC, and I'm just going to apply that all around my lip line, and I'm just going to bring it in just a little bit so that way when I put my lipstick on, it blends a lot easier and a lot more seamless. And because this is a darker color, I mean, in general, you always want to be careful applying lip liner to make sure it's nice and neat. But because it is darker, you definitely want to be more careful. And having that lip primer too makes my lips so smooth that I can actually take this lip liner and it goes on a lot easier. And this here is a pro long wear pencil. Having a pro long wear is also going to extend the longevity of your lip products too. So this is just another little tip and trick that you can use when trying to keep on your lip products. Always do for something that has pro long wear or extended wear. Those little keywords when searching for different products to use. Now we're just going to go in with our lipstick. Like I said, this one here is kind of sexy and I'm just going to apply this on all over the lips. I love this color. Now 
Now this lipstick here is a matte lipstick, but I always feel like sometimes with certain matte products or certain matte lipsticks that even though they say matte, they don't actually stay on with the longevity of a matte. So that's why I'm just going to take these extra steps to make sure that I have the longest wear out of what I'm going to do today. So you just want to rub your lips together, make sure everything's blended and seamless. I'm just going to go back in with my lip liner so that way you don't see any harsh lines. I'm just going to blend this out a little bit more. Perfect, just like that. And then what I'm going to do is, I'm just going to take a little bit of my translucent powder. And I already have some products already left here on the top. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go right in with the butt of the triangle wedge. And I'm just going to dip that right in. And then I'm just going to put this all over the lip. Now it doesn't matter if this gets on your face or on your skin or anything like that because it is translucent. You really can just dust it right off. And this one doesn't have any flashbacks so your color payoff will still be great and it will still be excellent in your pictures. Just like that. I look a little bit crazy right now, but it'll look perfect when we dust it off. And I'm just going to pat this right into the lip. Okay, and this is the finished lip. All I did was I applied my products and then I just went and just dusted it off off camera. So Honestly, it's that easy. That's all you have to do. You just need your primer, your lip liner, your lipstick, and a translucent powder. And that's it. And you know, just for you guys to see, I'll do the kiss test too on the back of my hand so you can see that this product does not move at all. Look at that. Absolutely nothing. So I hope you guys really, really, really enjoyed this video. And you're really going to love the start of my new series called Tip Tuesdays. So if you guys like little videos like this, please don't forget to thumbs up, rate, comment, subscribe, all of that, guys. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. And I hope to see you guys in my next video. All right. Bye, guys.